the AP Calculus exam, not only how to survive, but how to prevail. The AP Calculus exam is the culmination of all the years you've spent in high school studying mathematics. It has all led up to this. The calculus you study in this, your last high school year, completes the prior years of preparation, which started even before high school. Keep these things in mind as you go through this school year. Everything in calculus and in mathematics in general is best understood numerically, graphically, and analytically. And we say analytically, I mean by the use of equations and symbols. Look at everything from these three perspectives. Look at how the relationships between them, the same ideas, will show up in equations, numbers, which are usually presented as tables, and in graphs. Learn the concepts. The exam emphasizes concepts. Learn the procedures and formulas. Even though the concepts are more important than the computations, you still have to do the computations. Like it or not, learn to do the algebra, the arithmetic, and the graphs. Learn to be methodical. Work neatly and carefully all year. Think about what you're doing. Watch yourself work. It is natural to concentrate on the material you know and can do, but you need to concentrate on the things you do not yet know how to do. You can learn a lot from your mistakes. Look at a wrong answer as a green light to go in that direction until you've reached the right answer. The free response section of the test rarely requires long complicated computations. If you find yourself doing a long complicated computation, you've probably gone wrong somewhere and should start over. So this is a brief introduction to what to look for in the test and the attitude you should take with regard to that test. Good luck and thanks for viewing.